Happy New Year. I hope you guys had a really good holiday. My Christmas and New Year's was super quiet because I've been moving into my new house. Like I don't go all out for like Christmas and New Year's anyways. It's just more like mellow vibes. <laughs> anyways, I am back today with a new video and it's going to be a haul video because I know you guys miss those. And also expect a new homeware haul coming up. Um, I wanted to show you guys some bits that I got from my house and I'm not sure if that's gonna be like one very lengthy video or it's gonna be two, like part one, part two because there's a lot of things I really wanna show you guys and yeah, I kinda went crazy, especially in H&M Home. So I'm just gonna get on with this one and I hope you enjoy the pieces that I picked. So first up, it is a pair of trainers from Whistles. So yeah, I have a few pieces from Whistles. Um, they are from Label Online, which is a sister store of Next. And this is not sponsored or anything, I just really like the pieces and I thought I would show you guys. The trainers that I picked are these white um, classic trainers. So it's these ones and I really like the um, kind of like crocodile detail that they have going on. It just makes the trainer a little bit more um, interesting than, you know, a plain white one. I, this is still really minimal and classic and still really feminine. So yeah, I went for these and they look absolutely comfortable so I can't wait to wear these. Um, I got these in a size 37. So next up is a bomber jacket from Whistles. I got it in a maroon colour instead of the black one just because I thought, you know, try something new. <laughs> Let's go outside the box and see how that goes. And I am absolutely obsessed with this. I really like how lightweight it is. I really like the texture as well that's on the coat. Yeah, I probably could have got it in a medium as well. Um, but I thought, you know, I want it to be slightly fitted. So I went for a small. So the next item that I picked up from Whistles are these really comfortable tailored joggers. These are super comfortable and I really like that they are navy. They also have pockets. And um, yeah, I just really like the striped detail on the side. And again, it will go really well with my bomber jacket because of the maroon. Got this in a size eight. Last item from Whistles is this super soft um, boyfriend tee. It just says Amour on it. And I just wanted something that I can easily throw on with like a leather jacket and just go out the door and, you know, be pretty chic. And um, yeah. This, this is absolutely perfect. Picked it up in a size small. Oh, I thought I picked it up in a medium, but it's a small. Um, but anyways, it's oversized, it's baggy, it's super soft, so I know I'll probably be living in this for a while. So next up we have another pair of trainers, but this time it's from Adidas, and it's these. These are, oh my gosh. I was unboxing them and I was just so, so happy with these. These are the tubular shadows. Oh, 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 clumsy. I was debating for a while whether to get the grey or the cream because online the cream looked quite yellow and I didn't really like that. Um, but yeah, so I'm really glad that I went for these because these are absolutely amazing. Since these were from the children's section, I got them for $59.99. Next up is another pair of shoes, but it's the last pair of shoes you will see in this haul. So yeah, um, I saw these. I saw these on Public Desire and I kind of lost my shit. Like, how beautiful are these? They are actually really comfortable as well. And I think these were actually only like $29.99. And also, Public Desire run a lot of discount codes, so I think I got mine for cheaper, but I can't remember how much. So happy with these. Next up is an item from the Zara sale. I haven't really found anything that I like um, online or in store, um, but I came across this and I was 
really obsessed with it. I've been looking for a silk blouse for a while now. Um, something that isn't like too dated and when I wear it like it doesn't make me look stupidly old. So I found this one on Zara and it went down to £12.99 so I thought I would get it. I mean for £13 I was like yeah why not. Um, so yeah this is the only thing I brought from Zara lately and I got it in a size medium and again I think this one on me fits so much better um, than any of the other ones and it looks definitely like so much more expensive than what it is. I absolutely love this. So next up is an item from Topshop. I have been eyeing this up for a while and then I kind of just like yeah I'm just gonna get it. Like I needed another hoodie anyways because I have been in loungewear for like the past three weeks. <laughs> I haven't really gotten dressed or ready apart from Christmas obviously but um yeah so I got this hoodie from Topshop. It's by um, and finally who makes like the softest t-shirts ever. I got this hoodie and it's a Slayer hoodie and it is so comfortable and so pretty. Absolutely love. Yes I do listen to Slayer before any of you annoying people be like but you don't listen to Slayer. Yes I do. But this is a size medium and it was £38. Next up are two items from Revolve. Um, they are from a label called LPA and I'm obsessed with LPA. Like, seriously obsessed. So when I got my hands on these shirts, I was so happy. And they are exactly the same shirt, but just in two different shades. They are also velvet. So. I got these two. So the, one of them, I think this one is like a midnight blue and this one is like a really deep purple. Gosh, I am so obsessed with these. I can't wait to wear these with like high-waisted vintage Levi's and brogues or even with the white trainers or even with boots. Oh, there's so many options that I could wear these. But yeah, I am so obsessed with these and I mean, look how beautiful the colour is. I got both of them in a size small and they are a slightly oversized fit as well. Next item we have is a diary. This one is by Bando and it's a 17 month agenda um, diary. I just really like the fact that it says I am very busy because I am very busy and um, it comes with stickers so you know it's 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 10 points there um, so yeah the stickers are like super cute um, but the only thing that really annoys me inside is there's like a like this whole ch oh like this whole chunk I can't use because it's for like half of last year it kind of starts like right in, not in the middle, but you know, it's, it's like a waste of paper for me, but I was like, it's fine, I'll just use them to like doodle and do notes and stuff, but oh, it's just aesthetically pleasing and it's so, so lovely. Um, I ordered this from Oliver Bonus, and now the last item in this haul is something I picked up from Urban Outfitters um, beauty section. Um, it's the Herbivore Cosmetics or Herbivore Beauty um, Rose Hibiscus Coconut Water Hydrating Face Mist. I can't remember how much this was, but I mean, this smells incredible. I also have the Jasmine um, Hairspray as well, or like Hair Mist, or I think they call it actually Hair Perfume, and it smells amazing. I'm going to try more of this brand out. I really want to try out their like... Um, I think it's, they do bath salts and stuff as well, so I'm going to order those. I am a little bit obsessed with this product. I haven't used it that much, but I am in love with it already. I'll leave a link to this down below as well. So yeah, that was my first haul video of 2017, and I hope you guys enjoy it. Also, let me know which item was your favourite down below, and also, I will be back with the homeware haul really soon. Oh. 
I'll probably film it like tomorrow. So <laughs> I'll try to get that up for you as soon as possible. So I will see you guys soon. Bye guys.